Hi YouTube and friends. Today we are going to discuss about Next.js hot reloading issue. As you can see here, I have purposefully made dashboards. There are many S there, right? So if I go to change that here, my Next.js is running at port 3000. So I put PPP, okay? So it should hot reload by default, but it's not hot reloading, you see? So if I refresh, it doesn't hot reload. So what I'm going to do here is, the first trick that you had to do here is, let's list the files here. You can see here there's a dot next file right or folder so what we have to do is remove it by the way I am using git bash here in Windows operating system Windows 10 so next dot next we have to delete that's the first trick you have to do so list and check again ls minus al so if we check again, the next folder has gone. So we had to recompile it. By the way, I'm using yarn run develop, not npm. npm also can be used. As you can see, it has changed to PPP, right? Now let's try to change the correct way and let's look at it. It didn't change hot reload right so if we stop the server and recompile again and refresh it has become correct but again under this condition if I change it back to SSS it doesn't hot reload so we are going to rectify the second issue the second issue that knowingly or unknowingly you may face is that you see here that I have imported header and footer this way. So the header and footer file is small letters, right? And from the documents I read, they say that for Next.js, it is better to have small letters as the .js files. So here I am importing header. So for example, let me go into the header and show you. I'm exporting header as big letter, big H, right? So that is not an issue. The file must be small letter. So when I look at the layout, this should be small letter. So header and then footer. That's the second mistake which we can do so that hot reloading stops for Next.js. So in order to enable it, so what we will do is we will delete the next file again, .next file. We have deleted. We will check again is it there or not. It's not there in the list, right? So we will yarn run development again. And now if we look at the terminal, and refresh okay it is with the so many s there right so now i'm going to change the so many s there just to demo for you guys so i am going to make it as dashboard itself and if we look at it you can see the hot reload happening so let's add one more menu for example my new menu so i reload how reload is working can you see it is immediately coming so if i delete that save immediately it has gone so this is how we re-enable hot reload okay so hope this is a time saver for you and then 
if you like my videos please subscribe to my channel and show your moral support thank you very much for watching the video hope it saved your day thank you bye bye